Right, bish bash bosh, keep it tosh. As you can see, I'm having a walk around the bowl syndicates, seeing what these fish are up to and see whether they're spawning. But I've not picked the camera up today to talk about that. I've uh, wanted to give you a little bit of an update regarding my carp fishing because this week uh, it's taken a turn uh, for the better, I believe. Um, that's because about four years ago, I met a guy on Acton Burnell named Scott Rogers and uh, we got chatting uh, about this bait he was using. He was absolutely smashing Acton on it and um, he was doing really, really well. Got talking to him and he was telling me about this new bait he was, he was, he was working on which was called the All Season Mix. And the new company which he started up uh, with another guy named Richard Cox. That company is Key Bait Solutions. I will put a uh, link to the description below. Now, just before I left Acton, uh, Scott gave me about 2kg of what he had left for me to try. Um, I've got to be honest, I didn't try it until a couple of months after. I put it in my freezer and it wasn't until my other supply run out that I got it out of the freezer, defrosted it and took it to a water that I was fishing over the winter, uh, put 2kg out on that spot uh, that I fished before and lo and behold I had two of the biggest fish in the lake out of it and um, sticking in my mind I uh, continued to use, believe it or not, continued to use my other bait which I'd had success on and it won't until the early, well, late last, like last year, probably about September, uh, the bait company that I was using, uh, unfortunately, didn't have any uh, bait in stock. So I uh, gave Scott a ring and asked him if he could send me some bait over and supply me some bait, which he did. And um, I was going on holiday, so I needed this bait urgently, and he got it through, uh, I think it was in, I think it took the best couple of days just to come through. And uh, I went on holiday with it, done well on holiday, brought it back to here. I thought, well, while well, I've got it, I might as well use it. And lo and behold, I had quite a lot of the fish out of here, all them regionals, the parrot, uh, rubiks, them other regionals out, well, mostly all the fish out of here going on from September onwards. And um, I'll probably stop using it last in January um, well to be fair I haven't been down here have I I've put a bit of bait out but uh, not a lot anyway uh, probably about a month ago I got a call from Scott because he knows I run West Midlands Carpers chasing chunks and I deal with quite a lot of anglers he asked me whether I would like to uh, come on board and uh, whether I know anybody that would like to come on board his team and uh, try out um, his baits for the uh, coming season. I've got to be honest, I refused. I refused because I didn't think it'd benefit my video blogs and um, I didn't think, I, I really didn't want to go pushing bait on, on my video blogs to um, the people, my viewers. So I decided uh, to turn it down. However, I sat on that uh, decision uh, for quite a few weeks and the more the time went on the more uh, appealing it did become so I'll give Scott a ring back up and, and asked him you know uh, got some details off him and asked him whether you know uh, he'd want me to um, push it full time um, on the uh, on my blogs which he, he understood you know that that, that can't happen and um, you know I, I, I'm quite happy just to run through the bait I'm using but you know it is really one of my patterns with bait companies you know where they're throwing bait in your face trying to get you to sell it I'm not going to do that I'm going to let the bait do the talking and I told Scott this you know that, that you know I know it's a good bait he knows it's a good bait so there's there is no need for me to uh, do the hard sell we'll let uh, we'll let that bait do the talking and uh, as we go forward we're gonna do that um, so 
after all the time that people have asked me over the years uh, to come on board their teams and I've refused uh, finally a uh, good bait company as uh, should I say uh, got me on board and I'm really looking forward to uh, putting the results on the mat with a good bait now I went down to the um, unit or shop yesterday they do four baits in their range they do a ASM which is already tried tested bait it's already smashing waters all up and down the country and uh, it really really does produce fish uh, they also do a, a maxi nut maxi nut which is obviously a nut uh, based um, boilie they also do a twisted peach which is Scott is using as at present uh, but I decided to go on with their new flagship bait which is just a summer bait at the moment which is the maxi fish now this is, this maxi fish is a hint of cranberry with 80% fish meal in it so um, obviously at this time of year now they've spawned you are really up against the naturals the naturals are in full flow so what you're doing now really is trying to nick a bite on waters because then fish are going to be harmed onto uh, on, onto the natural. So obviously bringing up the um, attraction of the, the fish meal, right, is really going to put it in competition with these um, with these natural. So I've uh, decided to jump onto uh, that maxi fish, and uh, obviously as it's goes through into the winter I will get on to a more winterised bait which is the all season mix twisted peach and um, maybe the max enough we'll, we will see but yeah I'm really looking forward to um, really looking forward to trying the bait out getting a bit of confidence in it and uh, hopefully put a few chunks on that so that's where we are and uh, Hopefully we'll have a good season with uh, key bait solutions. So, fish, bash, bosh, keep it tosh. All the links are going to be in the description below. Just click on them if you want to have a look around the uh, key bait solutions website. I will also leave their Facebook page as well for you to go and have a look at. But for now, wet nets, tight lines. See you very shortly on the next block. See ya.